Hey guys, this is the Super Review Show for this first time ever episode of season reviews for TV shows. And this is the season one review of The X-Files. Yes, The X-Files season one review. Spoilers ahead, folks, if you haven't seen it. But this is just a review of the entire season, what we've come to so far, how Mulder and Scully are doing their things, etc. First things first. It's the pilot, pilot episode. Starts out great. You, so Scully is sent to s- tell Agent Mulder, hey, you know, these X-Files are done. You know, it's a thing in the past, blah, blah, blah. And Mulder takes Scully on an investigation regarding an X-File. And that's how this the show starts, as you will. And that's how the two of them meet, and they, ha- they have their interactions, and they go from there forward. Uh, episode 2 or 3. Uh, uh, episode 2, you meet the character Deep Throat. Who was a he? We don't know where, who he works for. Anyways, we don't know how he, who he works for or what he does, or whatever. But all all we know is that he has a lot of intel and helps out Mulder for most of the time. So that's episode two. You know, the, I'm just giving you the gist of it. Uh, three, see, ep- season th- season two episode no season one episode three. You mean the guy the the man named Eugene Toomes? And yes, he is the guy that stretches out his fingers as long as possible to, to the point where they're about this long. Um, he's just, he, honestly, scared the crap out of me. He can go through vents, he can come into your system and all that. Go th- come through your p- pipes, and he can scare you. Um, that was ridiculous. That was ridiculous. I will say that, though. That was pretty crazy stuff. And, but not only that, but episode four, episode four was just a typical X-File. You know, hey, oh, there's a, there's a man running around that's, who still hasn't adapted to, Evo- evolved to human capabilities in the earlier part of the parts of the show, um, where it turns out it's a woman and she's been in the woods forever, and they do some tests on her. She's doing all right, stuff like that. Uh, other w- in another episode, they actually in season one they actually had a case where in um, a Bigfoot type creature, no, not, not a Bigfoot, a man that could turn into a werewolf, cu- actually does turn into a werewolf and actually attacks. And some nearby f- folks in the town in Seattle, Washington. Uh, another episode when uh, with Eugene Toomes again. He he comes back and he 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 attacks Mulder. Mulder goes down underneath an escalator, and underneath the escalator, and at, while underneath the escalator, he also. What does he do? Sorry, um, Mulder takes. He you know he tries to get out of him, and then he pulls him out, and then he turns on the escalator. And crushes tombs so he can you know, crushes him, which is pretty disgusting. Not gonna lie, he just gets crushed by that. Um, there's an, there, there, I'm trying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not going in order, but I'm just trying to remember exactly. There was oh, there was one episode where they had to deal with a, spa- a, a an alien in space, where they're talking. They're actually, they're on mission control, and the space station people are like, "What the hell? You know what's going on up here? There's a, there's something outside the spacecraft. Blah blah, blah stuff like that." And they eventually solved that, and that was good. Uh, the episode before that is where they go to the Arctic. It, it this episode is like the thing, the movie, the thing, and it goes to. Uh, it's this little parasite that's about this big. It goes in your ear and infl- and it takes over your body, and it you know kills you. Uh, they they solved that no problem. One guy got died. One one guy died, but uh, people die. In, in shows like this, that people die. Another episode was when the um, they go to the woods, and these these this entire crew of tree loggers they they take out their wood, uh, they, 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 not their wood. Sorry about that. They take out they're cutting down trees, but when they're cutting down one under one of the trees, a ring is inside, and the ring is filled with bugs that is n- that haven't come out of the ground and they actually cocoon their en- their prey so to speak. It's pretty crazy stuff. Not gonna lie, it's actually really 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 crazy. But that's me. But that that's one episode. Another episode was when I'm trying to think back. Huh. I don't think I can remember that that, that far back. Um Oh yeah, there's, there's another episode where I, I think it's in the same episode where you first meet Deep Throat is actually where he you actually see the um, UFO w- the Area 51 area, and they're they're doing their stuff. So yeah, but 
Yes. Oh, and then there's the actual finale of the um, the, se- the season finale of the X Files itself, uh, where deep. This is remember this is spoiler spoiler stuff. Deep Throat gets shot, and after Deep Throat gets shot, you know Mo- Scully has to save Mulder by giving an alien to an unknown facility, and the and the unknown pe- the, un- the unknown group give the alien to the Pentagon and the Smoking Man. Um, collects it and puts it in, put it puts it in his uh, collection, if you will. There you go. So that's the season one review of the X Files. Spoilers filled, obviously, mind you. And but for all your super, for all your X Files, for all for all, for all your X Files news, keep it locked on the Super Review Show. I'll see you later.